When looking at art and also looking at uh, art from the perspective of art history, a little bit more formalized, a little bit more uh, disciplined uh, way of looking at art, <clears throat> then looking at, at early subjects is always important. And in this case, we're looking at uh, early green Tara paintings and a couple of textiles. And you would think that there would be a lot of green Tara uh, examples, but, but there's really, there's not that many at all, actually. What we have is we have, <clears throat> on the Har website, we have uh, a very early Kadam painting, which we're, we're dating to, to really the 11th century. It has uh, an image of, a small image of uh, Atisha and then another of Dromton in the upper uh, left and, and right sides, so viewers left and viewers right, and then an unidentified uh, donor figure at the lower right corner. But the painting is early. Um, we, can, we can say um, it can't be before the, the 11th century. It's possible that it's early, early 12th, of course. Uh, then the next we have um, Alchi Monastery. Now, we don't have any examples yet up on the Har website, but possibly end of today and uh, in the following um, days and weeks, we will have more images of murals from Alchi Monastery. Uh, there are several uh, Tara's uh, murals, and these can be dated to, to really 11th through 13th century. We're not always sure when certain chapels were finished or when uh, chapels were possibly damaged and had to be refurbished and repainted. Um, we have two examples of green Tara from Retting Monastery. One is a one-face two-armed, and currently that painting is in the Walters Museum in Baltimore. Uh, then the the other painting is a four-faced, four-armed green Tara, and, and these two are both in the same style. And I say retting because they're in this early retting style. One of the paintings is a scroll work in the Walters, the other is a mural in Retting Monastery. Um, and uh, these can be dated to very late um, 11th century into the um, end of the uh, uh, 12th century. Um, now, then we have uh, two shisha textiles. One is in the Hermitage in, um, in Russia, in St. Petersburg. And the other a smaller one is in the Asian Art Museum, San Francisco. And these are quite early and they're dated to the, um, well, they're, they're identified as being um, uh, shisha or, or Western Shia or Tangut in origin. And, and this is a, a tribal group that was basically wiped out by uh, um, Kublai Khan in the 13th century. Uh, then we have uh, uh, we have an example from West Tibet. We have an absolutely beautiful, world famous example from uh, Kathmandu Valley, and that's the Green Tara, often known as the Cleveland Tara, because it resides at the Cleveland Museum of Art. And then we have a painting from Asia Society, New York, and and this is it's a little bit hard to say if it's um, it's most likely Tsang Province and then more to the west side, not central Tibet, not U, and also it's also done more in an Indian style. So we're looking at at um, at tenth, uh, eleventh, twelfth century uh, paintings, and. Um, the Alchi ones are in Kashmir style, the Retting are in Indian style, then we have some Shisha, and then we have a Nepalese, um, a very much Kathmandu Valley. So just just having a quick look at, at what are the early examples is a really good lesson and a really good study also in regional style, but also the, the individual styles, artistic styles, looking at the um, elements and uh, unique characteristics of the, of the different painting styles plus the two textiles. So you can press the like button, you can join Har on Patreon, you can subscribe. And you can also make a donation on the homepage of Himalayan Art Resources.